before I say any more, I'll let you tune in. Hi to everybody on uh, channel 991 and uh, everybody back in Europe. I made it to the US, for better or worse. <laughs> I uh, came back to see my family here in Missouri. I, uh, I'm coming to you from my porch. I could give you a, a small tour. Here is my view of the grapevine. And those are the fields back there. So this is a farm that my uh, great-grandparents moved to in the 20s almost a hundred years ago and uh, yeah my grandpa was a farmer here from the time he was a kid till when he passed away basically and now my family and I live here and this is my cabin but I'm gonna play you some songs I, uh, I have no plan so if you have any request feel free to shoot me one I'm just playing to all those people in quarantine and uh, yeah, my family that's over in the house down the road. <laughs> I feel like playing you a song. It's a uh, song that I wrote a couple months ago about being in quarantine. I guess uh, I guess a lot of you could relate. <laughs> Let me just find it here in my notebook. Hey, Zoe. It's nice to see the family getting together. But this is a song that I never released because I just wrote it. A couple months ago, I wrote it. Lock the door.
So, welcome to uh, the lockdown live stream here, coming to you from St. Genevieve, Missouri. Uh, for all you folks that are tuning in from Europe, I, uh, yeah, I was one of the crazy guys that uh, flew across, oh, from Cyprus. Man, I'm jealous. That sounds nice. Um, I hope that you guys are having fun down there. Um, yeah, um, I was one of the crazy ones that flew across the Atlantic Ocean a week ago. I uh, flew on, on one of these big, big planes. I think it was a 737 with Austrian Air from Vienna to New York. And on that plane that usually fits like two or three hundred people, uh, there were 15 people, one five. <laughs> it was pretty weird. And I got back here and I've been socially distancing from my family with a lot of barbecues outside which has been very nice. And uh, yeah, I'd like to introduce you to someone. This is Dolly. This is uh, the guitar that I play here in the US, if you can see. It's a JP Rushing. It's uh, a really nice guitar. I got it down in Nashville a couple years ago. The reason I call it Dolly is because um, it was made by this luthier who used to work at Dollywood, <laughs> which is Dolly Parton's uh, amusement park down in Tennessee, in Gatlinburg, or in Pigeon Forge, actually. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, Dolly. <coughs> like Dolly Parton. But, um, yeah, I'm coming to you here from my porch. It's, uh, it's a pretty pleasant place to be, though I could imagine that Barcelona is also nice, Leia. And uh, Vienna is also nice, Nova and Malena are Munich. I don't know what I want to play, but I feel like, hey, yo, I, I don't know. Let me see. I'll play a new one. I've written a few songs back here. I always write songs while I'm in my cabin. And, uh... I could play play you one that I just wrote a couple days ago. I hope to see you in Munich in January too. Hopefully these damn concerts happen. Shit. But yeah, so here's the song that I just wrote. Let's see if I know how to play it. The romantic in me Well, lately she's been losing To my other side The one I've been fighting for so long Ain't it just my luck For someone to come along And bring it out the romantic in me want to run and hide away cause it feels like growing up like stumbling towards the grave forever young my romantic she will stay but who am I Side in my 
that's a brand new song that I just wrote the other day. Maybe I'll post it on Patreon. For those of you who are supporting that Patreon page, thanks for doing that. I hope that you're enjoying these songs that I send out every week. Um, yeah, if you got any requests, I'd be happy to play them. This is being broadcast in my uh, hometown on channel 991. Thanks to Don and all the fine folks down there who do that. And for uh, everybody who's watching this back in Europe, I'm here in St. Genevieve. For those of you just tuning in, this is my view uh, from my farm. There's the grapevines. There's the fields. Over there's the water tower. Evidence that this is St. Genevieve. <laughs> and... Uh, if uh, if any of you have been following the Instagram feed lately, um, my go-kart track is right over there. <laughs> but uh, I got a Hank Williams request from my dad. So I think I'll do that since last night we were drinking margaritas and it hollowed out a place in my skull where my memory used to be. Sounds too blue to cry. That midnight train is winding low. I'm so lonesome, I could cry. Have you? an old Hank Williams song for my family who's watching literally, um, I don't know, 150 feet away from here. That's uh, 5 million meters in metric. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I want to play. Maybe I'll play some more country songs. If anybody's got requests... song. It feels very fitting to play country songs here on the farm. Every time I come back here, I always end up writing country songs. I, uh, I posted one on the Patreon page last week that I wrote. Hey, Bobsy. Cowboys ain't easy to love and they're harder to hold. They're more likely to give you a song than diamonds or gold. Lone Star belt buckles and old faded Levi's. Just right away
just won't know how to take them. He ain't wrong, he's just different, but his pride won't let him do the things to make you think that he's right. Mamas, don't let your baby. and all the new folks that are tuning in. Um, I'm coming to you from St. Genevieve, Missouri. I made it back safe and sound. Hopefully they let me back into Europe one day. Yo. Um, yes, I do have the BB gun here. I uh, am happy to say that it still works. And I'm too hungover to aim it. <laughs> but I... Uh, I'd be happy to play you some songs from the new album. I've been making some plans to make some music videos for this this album. Some It's been difficult though with all these social distancing uh concerns. But uh yeah. Hopefully it works out and hopefully I'm able to come back to Europe afterwards, see my family for now. But um I think I want to play this song. This is a song called Triple A Station, which is going to be on the. Uh, yeah, I'm happy. This song is going to be on the album that I'll release one day, maybe later this year, um, maybe tomorrow, maybe next year. I don't know. <laughs> Everything's been turned on its head since this uh, virus came along. But um, this is a song called Triple A Station. That I wrote for these radio stations here in the Midwest that if you dial through the uh, or you scan through the dial on the radio and most of the stuff on on uh, on the air is just total shit and finally you get to one of these stations like KDHX here in St. In, in Missouri uh, in St. Louis and uh, it's a little bit of a island a little bit of a salvation in between all these religious things and I wrote this song for them. On an endless drive through the end times of America Scanning through evangelist on the dial Static you Gotta keep your eyes on what's ahead of you Somewhere out of nowhere I heard a familiar voice For a while Coming in clear Triple A station on the air tonight Triple A station, take me for a ride. Triple A station, play what I don't know. Triple A station, won't you save my soul?
months in a touring van but sometimes only a stranger's song will do That's a song called Triple A Station. Triple uh, A Station is a type of radio format. Um, I think that it means adult Americana alternative or album alternative Americana. I don't know, but I like the idea and I could relate to all of those concepts. <laughs> um, but that's gonna be on the record. And uh, hopefully we can make some videos for it. I'm right into work now, but I'm going to... <laughs> uh, so Max is wearing the Canadian tuxedo. Max, I got a Canadian tuxedo here in Missouri. I think I'm going to put it in a music video. It's one that my... Uh, <laughs> it's one that my grandma made for my dad back in the 70s. And if anyone doesn't know what a Canadian tuxedo is, it's basically just an all-denim outfit. So, it's pretty much what I wear all the time. But I, uh, I feel like playing another song from the new record. This is how the, uh, <laughs> this is how the album's gonna start. I wrote this song down in Nashville right after I bought this guitar. <laughs> You're watching that on the train? Shit. Foxy, travel safe. <laughs> but I, uh, I wrote this song on this guitar. If uh, you're just tuning in, this guitar is named Dolly, after Dolly Parton. Thanks a beat. It's not as nice as your sass. All right, is it a sass or a yurt? Or a yurt? I can't. I can never remember. I need to learn how to play that thing. That's pretty cool. But um, yeah, this is Dolly, named after Dolly Parton. <laughs> and I call her that because um, the guy who built this, a sass, yeah, uh, the guy who built this worked at Dolly Parton's amusement park down in Tennessee, Dollywood. But this is a song called Maybe a Little More. gave you before just better maybe a little more maybe a little more maybe a little more maybe a little more, maybe a little more. Maybe a little more, maybe a little more. Trust me, baby, you got nothing to lose. Just Maybe a little more, maybe a little 
I find you I'm gonna make you a wedding farewell we don't have to lie anymore well maybe a little more It's a new song. Well, it's not that new, but it's going to be on the new album. Uh, it's called Maybe a Little More. And uh, for those of you who are just tuning in or who haven't watched these live streams before, the reason I do it is basically for my family who is watching um, over in that house behind me. <laughs> usually, usually I'm about 5,000 miles away. Um, ooh, Unchained Melody. Um, usually I'm about 5,000 miles away, but now I'm back in Missouri to see them, socially distanced, of course, but I, uh, got the test done and it should be safe now to see each other, more or less. Um, yeah, and yeah, I'm doing these for them and for all of you who can't see concerts right now because of Corona. I hope that you're all safe and healthy wherever you may be, whether you're watching from Austria or Germany or the U.S. or from Cyprus or from Spain or from South Africa or where, wherever you guys are tuning in from, are here in St. Genevieve on the Fisher family farm. So Grandma wants to hear Unchained Melody. I don't really know if it's a good idea. <laughs> Last time I played it, I didn't think that I sung it very well. It's really high. Um, I just don't remember what the bridge is. I don't know what the bridge is. Godspeed, your love. 
to me Oh my love my That was a song from my grandma that I do not know how to play, obviously. <laughs> but I, uh, I think I'll do another song or two uh, for all those folks who can't go see concerts right now. This is just a little gift to you guys. If you, uh, if you want to hear any songs um, that I haven't released, then you could go to the Patreon page that I'm hosting now. And... Uh, Get a song every week. Um, but I don't know when I'll do one of these live streams again. I might do one um, later in the month. I'll let you know. I'll post it a few days before I do it. Um, if you enjoy these, I appreciate you tuning in. And I appreciate all the people that are members of the Patreon page. Um, I'm happy to send you songs. That's the next thing I'm going to do right after I eat breakfast. It's 10 a.m. or 10.30 or 11 or whatever time it is here in Missouri. I hope that all you folks back in uh, back in Europe are doing well. Sarah and Bernd. I, I can never pronounce your name, Bernd. I, it always comes out the German way. One day I'll learn. One day I'll learn. But um, I don't know. I don't know what to play. Maybe another song of mine from the new album. I think I'll do that. There's this old expression that a country song is just three chords and the truth. Hey man. <laughs> but there's this expression that three that a country song is three chords and the truth and I put that into a song that's gonna be on the new album. too, you know. Usually I live in Europe, but now I'm back in Missouri. It's good to be back. They say that a song is just three chords and the truth. Well, I've been up all night trying to write about anything but you. Will I make it 
exception sometime when I try Though a song ain't no good when it's based on a lie And I play more than three chords And I can't deny that I loved you And you're still in each song I write with my back against the wall Just something we use to decorate space. I've been using it lately to say what I can't to your face. Well, I make exceptions sometime when I try. Wait, no, those aren't the words. <laughs> That's a song called uh, Three Chords and the Truth. It's going to be on the new album, whenever that may be. Hopefully later... Oh, and that's, that's too low. <laughs> Hopefully that album will be released later in the year, or early next year. Let's see. How many more uh, global pandemics or, uh, I don't know, pumpkin head presidents we have um, in, in between now and then. But, uh, yeah, it's funny being back in the Midwest. It's uh, it's good to be back to see the family and everything. Over in Europe, uh, it sounds like the U.S. is really like insane right now, but it doesn't feel as crazy as it sounds being here. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. I, it is pretty surprising though to drive around the country and see so many, so many Trump signs out. I uh passed somebody's house in Perryville the other day and they had I swear to god about 50 Trump signs out fucking fanatics that's crazy my uh my great uncle said uh comes to Trump and people following him. It's like uh, the chickens following Colonel Sanders. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I'm in the middle of nowhere, Bobsy. Right on, right on my farm. It's nice to be in the middle of nowhere here in St. Jen. I think I'll play uh, one more song for you folks. Um, it's a song that I wrote here in St. Genevieve um, about my hometown. <laughs> this is a song called Just Like a Stranger. Sometimes I get to wondering Where all this wandering began And way and how and what and when Of starting But 
the question is an answer to is when you can't find an answer you go out looking for someone to answer you middle america and middle class 20th century freshly passed end of history ending fast asking was told who are you to ask too much to suggest this is ain't enough to alter what we leave untouched can't you take it like it is and get back back in your place boy have a little faith what you want to study what you want to be don't be a stranger and avoid the jane danger of being on the outside of everything and then one point i got out of town took a trip without the rounds to make a living making sound and putting it in words always wondering how it'd be to move back to St. Genevieve to start a little family and do some settling down but I got sidetracked making contact with every point, place, face, and town. Did some living, did some thinking, and I did my fair share of rambling round. But when I got back, they'd say, get back in your place. Boy, this ain't the city Go back to where you came from I'd say, man, I came from here And though I might seem a stranger Our story is quite the same Though I could understand you I'm a stranger everywhere sometime I talk to myself when I can't find someone else who I feel like I could tell just how I really feel but some things round here can relate like the echo of that old freight train whining low and far away alone and out of place alone and out of place, boy Just like in the city Just like where you came from Just like everywhere Just like a stranger Looking for the manger And cursing the star that misled him here a song about St. Genevieve, where I'm from. It's nice to be reading the comments from everybody here from, uh, yeah, oh man, all the way from Minneapolis <laughs> and Festus and a train going through Germany. It's nice to feel connected to all of you at this time and place in this strange world that we're living in. Oh, and from Groningen. Uh, it's cool. <laughs> I saw that uh, Curtis Brewer tuned in. I was driving through Perryville um, just yesterday, and uh, I had to think of Curtis. I, uh, there's a sign in Perryville now, Perryville. There's a sign in Perryville now um, <laughs> that um, 
says it's Chris Jansen's hometown, and uh, I have to think of Curtis every time I see that sign. <laughs> <laughs> I want to play a song, uh, a song now. Uh, maybe just one last song um, that I wrote um, one time while I was at the uh, Ryman Auditorium. Um, down in Nashville. They call it the Mother Church of Country Music. It's where the Grand Ole Opry used to be. And um, I was there. I saw a concert of an old high school friend of Curtis's and I named Chris Jansen. And he got inducted into the Grand Ole Opry. And I was there when it happened. And I looked up in the rafters of this beautiful old church that they turned into a concert venue. And uh, I just imagined all these ghosts there that come out at night and sing along with each other. And I uh, wrote the song. I started writing it while I was sitting in the pews of the Ryman. Let's see if I remember it. <laughs> Take on that one. Bouncers on Broadway are singing along to a southern rock version of a Hank Williams song. And as I wonder where you are, I wonder am I just another one in a long, long line of dreamers and fools. Kicking the can up a Fifth Avenue, knocking on the door and filling the pews of the only church with the God I pray to. I am just a man, though I want to be more, like all of my unfulfilled idols before there's a star dying one being born but they all stick around this southern town and they all are singing at the rhyming tonight every ghost when they turn out the lights and the people go home oh it must be a sight to see all of the ghosts at the rhyming tonight Tootsies, I swear that I saw the shadow of Johnny or Roy A. Cough, maybe just the smoke of Willie, or maybe I'm wrong, but I can't help but dream, or at least write a song for the giants whose shoulders I've been standing on, whose words form the borders of maps that I've drawn who have made me a home and that home is longing for home and they all are singing at the rhyme in the night every ghost when they turn out the lights and the people go home hell it must be a sight to see all of the ghosts at the rhyming tonight And they all are singing at the rhyming tonight Every ghost when they turn out the lights And the people go home Oh, it must be a sight To see all of the ghosts at the
everybody. Thanks for tuning in. My name is Ian Fisher. I'm sure that you all know that already if you're watching this. <laughs> you're probably either friends or family of mine. So, or if you don't, then once again, my name's Ian Fisher. You can find me on the internet nowadays. <laughs> Hopefully I'll be able to play concerts again soon. Um, but thanks for tuning in. I'm coming to you from St. Genevieve, Missouri here. Wish me luck on getting back to Europe in a few weeks. And, uh, yeah, I'm wishing all of you luck on staying healthy. And uh, thank you for the new songs. Yeah, happily. I hope you like them. And, uh, yeah, if you want more new songs, I have a Patreon page where I post a new song every week. So uh, you could hear tons of new stuff. Um, but thanks for tuning in. And, uh, yeah, I'll let you know when I do another one of these. It might be in the next few weeks. But I, uh, oh, AAA Station? I already played AAA Station, but I'll do anything for you, Curtis. I'm just waiting for you to move over to Europe. It's just a matter of time. I'll play AAA Station again. This is uh, one last song from my old friend Curtis, who organized the first concert I ever played in Perryville, Missouri. Or, as some call it, Perryville, Missouri. Um, on December 30th, 2000... One, I guess. Ooh. Almost, uh, next year it'll be 20 years. I've been writing songs for 20 years already. Damn. But this is a song for Kurt, and uh, we're going to make a music video for this. I might be asking your help soon. So uh, please play Better Than I Learn. It's <laughs> uh, Bob C. Uh, I think we're going to do another uh, Acoustic Tuesday in September, so hopefully, hopefully it all works out. But this is a song, this is officially the last song. I've said that I'm going to do one last song 15 times now, but this is officially the last song. Um, it's called AAA Station. It's for Curtis. And for all you guys that are tuning in, thanks for listening. And I'm going to go eat breakfast as soon as I get done playing this song. On an endless drive through the end times of America Scanning through evangelists on the dial Static you Gotta keep your eyes on what's ahead of you Somewhere out of nowhere I heard a familiar voice for a while Coming in Someone when you're there, harder when you're not there, and hardest when you're somewhere in between. I'm gonna run out of time in 20 seconds. I'm just gonna play it to the very end. <laughs> 